Thank you, David, for those wonderful comments. Uh, good morning, everyone. Um, and uh, my name is Mike Sipser. I'm the Dean of Science at MIT. Uh, the Intelligence Quest embodies MIT's commitment to the pursuit of deep scientific inquiry around one of the most challenging problems of our time, how the brain produces intelligent behavior and how machines can safely and efficient, efficiently exhibit intelligent behavior. Many of today's advances, major advances in machine learning and artificial intelligence have benefited from science done years ago. Uh, future transformative advances in AI may very well require an understanding of the mechanisms of the human mind in engineering terms, a convergence of science and engineering. This constitutes the core of the MIT intelligence quest. MIT's strengths in brain and cognitive sciences and in computer science uniquely position us to lead the effort to understand intelligence. And our faculty and students believe the time is now. It is my privilege to introduce this session on the core of distinguished scientists and engineers who are working at the forefront of this quest. So I'm just gonna run through introductions of all of the folks who are gonna be speaking in this first session, and then they're gonna come up one by one to speak. So our first speaker is Jim DiCarlo, head of the Department of Brain and Cognitive Sciences at MIT, the Peter de Florenz Professor of Neuroscience and an investigator at the McGovern Institute for Brain Research. Jim's research goal is to reverse engineer the brain mechanisms that underlie visual intelligence. If you read Jim's piece in Wired Magazine last month, you may already know that he is confident that powerful insights in artificial and human intelligence can be gained by combining core research in engineering and in science. Um, after Jim, um, Daniela, Daniela Roos will speak. Daniela is the director of the Computer Science and Artificial Intelligence Laboratory, better known as CSAIL, and the Andrew and Erna Viterbi Professor of Electri Electrical Engineering and Computer Science. Her research addresses some of the gaps between the function of today's robots and the promise of future robots, increasing the ability of machines to reason, learn, adapt to complex tasks in human-centered environments. Daniela's talk will be on the future of intelligence engineering. After Daniela, uh, Tommaso Poggio will speak. Uh, Tommy is the Eugene McDermott Professor of Brain and Cognitive Sciences, an investigator at the McGovern Institute for Brain Research, and the director of the Center for Brains, Minds, and Machines, a multi-institutional center funded by the NSF. Tommy's research program posits that learning is at the core of the problem of intelligence, both biological and artificial. He aims to understand the processes that underlie, that underlie learning, memory, and reasoning, developing top-to-bottom computational models to explain how humans visually perceive the world around them. He will speak to us on the science and engineering of intelligence. Following Tommy in the session today will be Antonio Taralba. Antonio is a professor in the Department of Electrical Engineering and Computer Science and a member of CSAIL. He's also director of the MIT IBM Watson AI Lab. An expert in computer vision, machine learning, and human visual perception, Antonio's projects span a wide range, from investigating object recognition and scene understanding in pictures and movies, to studying the inner workings of deep neural networks. He will speak to us about teaching machines to see and hear. After that, we'll hear from Laura Schultz. Laura is a professor of cognitive science in the Department of Brain and Cognitive Sciences at MIT. She is also the principal investigator in MIT's Early Childhood Cognition Laboratory. Laura studies the representations and learning mechanisms that underlie our common sense understanding of the physical and social world, all of which is constructed during early childhood. After Laura in the program today is Rebecca Sachs, a professor of cognitive neuroscience in the Department of Brain and Cognitive Sciences and an investigator at the McGovern Institute. Rebecca studies the question, how does the brain, an electrical and biological machine, construct abstract thoughts? She will speak to us about how we go about building a social brain. And finally, uh, we will hear from Josh Tenenbaum. He'll be the last speaker in the morning session. Josh is a professor of computational cognitive science in the Department of Brain and Cognitive Sciences. He's a member of CSAIL and a researcher in the Center for Brains, Minds, and Machines. 
His research centers on perception, learning, and common sense reasoning with the twin goals of better understanding human intelligence in computational terms and building more human-like intelligence in machines. The machine learning and artificial intelligence algorithms developed by Josh's group are currently used by hundreds of other science and engineering groups around the world. Josh will conclude this morning's session with a talk on scaling artificial intelligence, but doing so the human way. So first, I will turn the podium over to Josh. Oh, to Jim, Jim, sorry.